Hi friends, I have been in a little bit of a funk the past couple days, but something came yesterday that kind of cheered me up a little bit. I got some new stuff from Trixie Cosmetics. This actually is my first time ordering from Trixie Cosmetics. Usually I've ordered from the actual website before like merch. So yeah, this is my first time trying Trixie Cosmetics. This box is adorable. I love that. Um, I got a palette and two lipsticks and I figured I would show you what they look like. I'll do some swatches on my arm of the palette and I'll show you what the lipsticks look like, like actually on my lips. Um, so opening it up, I already opened this up. I'm not gonna act like I didn't. You get this little card. This is packaged so nicely. This is beautiful. So, um, I actually did not get in time to order the one that came with, um, like a bunch of stuff. So I just ordered the palette and that's loud. Oh, this looks beautiful. So the palette comes wrapped nicely in bubble wrap. So cute. I know everything's backwards. I'm so sorry. Let's open it up. This looks so nice. This is like really well made. It's nice and thick. This palette is $48, so it's pretty on par for like other luxury palettes. I would consider this like a luxury palette. Oh my God. Oh my God. These shades are gorgeous. Like absolutely gorgeous. I don't have a lot of like really bright colors, especially in a palette that is like well made like this. Um, so I'm really anxious to try these out. And it also comes with stickers that you can put on your palette. This is very cute. You have like a Furby. Oh my God, I played this game so much. I still make these. I still know how to make these. That's like my flex. I introduced my like 12 year old niece to those one time and she played that for forever. <laughs> oh my gosh. So you have like jelly sandals. I was born in 1990s. So like this is my thing. Like I think this is um, modeled after like the dream phone and um, all of those kind of games from the 90s. Very cute. The packaging on this, oh my God. So I got Stacy, the lipstick Stacy, and beautiful, it's beautiful. It's not the most wearable color, but I am not the most wearable gal, you know what I mean? If I, even the inside is cute. This is like a hot pink. These lipsticks, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Like the packaging. What more do you want? This is the first shade. So it's Stacy. Should we put it on? Why not? Let's do the lipsticks first. Oh, this actually isn't, hang on, I'll come back with Ignore this. the fact that my lips are so dry. I don't know why I was sitting here trying on lipstick without like a lip treatment first. Why did I think that was a good idea? But this is such a wearable shade actually. This is so cute and despite my dry lips, I would wear this all the time. This is so cute to me. I don't know why I keep looking over here, I'm sorry. But yeah, this is called Stacy. This was on sale for $14.40, I believe. I had it written down and then I covered everything up. Stacy was $14.40. The other lipstick that I ordered was on sale for like $8. It's like an orange red. It's very cute too. But yeah, this is a really nice like Barbie pink shade that I think 
goes well with my skin tone. It just must not look too crazy on me. It looks really nice, I think, actually. I really like it. So I took that off. The next lipstick that we have is called Model Actress. This was on sale for $8. Same beautiful packaging. But this is a really beautiful, like, orangey, warm red coral tone. Am I the worst at describing colors? Let's see how this looks on. It's absolutely beautiful as well. I keep thinking I wouldn't be able to, like, wear any of these, but I could totally wear both of these all the time. So this is Model Actress. <laughs> Model Actress. This was on sale for $8 beautiful I think they might be discontinuing this maybe that's why it's so cheap but if you like that orangey red go out and get you one because this is beautiful okay so now that we've done that let's swatch the palette I'm gonna take all this plastic off first because that's my favorite part oh my gosh that felt really good Okay, so let's just start at the top. Oh, hi. <laughs> anyway, oh my God, you can see my messy room. We're gonna start with cooties. <laughs> so this is a beautiful green shade. Oh, wow. That's really pretty. There's cooties. This is like the worst swatching video. Oh wow, this is pretty too. This is called Speed Dial. Sugar Rush. This is a bright pink. Wow. Very pretty. That's very bright. This one's called MASH, which is that origami game. No, it's not. That's the game we used to play on paper. The origami game is where you answer questions and then like you get a thing at the end. <laughs> Mine always used to be stupid, like you're gonna smell poop or something. Like I was 10 years old. All right, let's go in again. This one's called Dear Diary. one's really pretty. My lighting is awful. I don't even know why I'm like showing you these, but let's just play with makeup. This, whoa, this one's called Jinx. And it is very beautiful. I don't even know if you'll be able to see it. It's that light pink. That's really pretty, like really pretty. Okay, here's star 67, which is what you want to press if you don't want other people to know where you're calling from. We're just going to go over my tattoos. Oh my god, this is awful. It's that yellow, very pretty. This one's called Little Sis. This is like a baby pink. So beautiful. And this one's called BFF for E and E. So forever and ever. Wow. That's a beautiful shade. And then lights out. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a darker purple. And then the last one we have is called Boy Band. This is like a nice Barney purple. Oh, it's dark. So here is the whole like color story in my arm. I'm sorry, this is very unprofessional, but I am just a 32 year old gal in my townhouse right now. I'm not a professional. So here's my arm. Aren't they pretty? I really think they're really pretty. <laughs> I 
I cannot wait to like play around with this palette. It has been a long time since I've bought a palette and I usually use the um, Tarte Tartist where it's just like nudes because I'm usually wearing like a bright lip or something like that but I've been getting into contacts more often so because I feel like you can't really see my eye makeup too well when I'm wearing my glasses but when I'm wearing contacts you can see like everything so I'm definitely going to be playing with some more colorful looks maybe we'll do like a look together with this palette I don't know I'm not super good at makeup I just like it um I'm not really I've I've seen people who are good at makeup and it ain't me it ain't me but I do enjoy it um so yeah that is my whole haul from T Tixie Trixie Cosmetics <laughs> Um, I should have two more videos actually coming this week. I have a Shein haul of some like looks that I picked up. I didn't realize it, but everything that I bought almost is like black. But I guess I'm just getting ready for like fall and winter. But I bought quite a few skirts. I bought a couple coats. Um, so I just wanted to show you those things that I got from Shein. And I also got some plugs, like some ear plug, like not ear plugs, but like for stretched ears from a place called Morbid Metals that I also wanted to film. They actually have some pretty unique plugs where they have dangles from them. Um, as you guys may or may not know, I have my ears stretched to a double zero. So I do still wear earrings with my plugs. I'll even, I'll hook my, like the metal part of the earring underneath, if that makes sense. So I still wear normal earrings, but I found some plugs that actually have danglies attached to them so they're really pretty. I got four pairs of um, plugs from Morbid Metals so I'll be maybe filming that video later today showing you guys those things but um, thank you for all the new subscribers and welcome. Say hi in the comments below. Um, I'm very happy that you're enjoying my videos and liked them enough to subscribe. <laughs> um, but other than that, that's about it, guys. I hope you're having a really good day. Um, like and comment below. Comment any videos that you might like to see from me. The ones that I think you guys will like um, don't do as well. And the ones that I'm like, who cares about this? You guys seem to really like. Like the tattoo tour and what's in my purse. Those videos are doing really well. And I'm like, who the heck would care about this? But apparently you guys do. So just let me know what other videos that you guys would like to see. Not my messy house, please. I am trying to clean up downstairs to show you guys because we actually have some really cool things. Um, we peruse the antique malls a lot. We like a lot of um, different decor, as you can probably tell by my style. <laughs> but um, we have a pretty cool, some pretty cool decor. So I wanted to show you guys that eventually, but our house is kind of a little bit of a mess right now. So I'm hoping to get that cleaned up and filmed. Um, other than that, my life has been consisting of playing Disney Dreamlight Valley all, all the time. I'm obsessed with it. I played Spirit Fair, didn't think I was going to find a game that I liked as much as that. I still don't like Disney as much as Spirit Fair. Spirit Fair is such a good game. If you guys like that type of game where it's just like a management game, um, you're like keeping people happy. Like if you like Harvest Moon, Animal Crossing, Stardew, things like that, I think you'll really like Spirit Fair. Try it out. I can't recommend it enough. Um, I also been playing Witchwood. That's been pretty cute. And Cozy Grove. Are you guys interested in games? I'm getting like very much back into games and makeup, like my old hobbies. So let me know if you guys even care about this or think that you'd be interested in hearing about it at all. Um, but yeah, I've been playing my Switch a lot. Um, I'm really excited to maybe get a Steam Deck in the next couple of months when they come out. There's a lot of games that I've really would like to play on that, so. But anyway, now that I went off on a tangent, hope you guys are having a good day, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!